the patients with uh, conjunctival paralysis, medical and the th possible surgical management becomes unnecessary. Medically, I prefer to use a short course of non-preserved uh, topical steroid to reduce associated inflammation. This is particularly useful in the presence of delayed tear currents. There is about 70% of chance the patient may note transient improvement. It is also important to manage the associated conditions such as uh, aqueous deficiency dry eye, Demodex, brephritis, and other diseases as well at this point. However, when symptoms become uh, refractory to maximum medical uh, treatment, the surgery could be considered. In the past, uh, several surgical procedures have been uh, reported, namely, use a suture fixation of the conjunctiva to the scura without uh, making any conjunctival resection. A crescent excision of the conjunctiva in the redundant area with direct suture closure. And the division of different conjunctival area for resection and closure. And recently, uh, a new surgical technique based on crescent excision of the redundant conjunctiva and reconstruction with cryopreserved amniotic membrane have been reported with or without the use of sutures. The surgical technique we would like to introduce here includes the removal of remaining loose tenon capsule, the recession or the resection of sometimes the conjunctiva if it's redundant, and then push the conjunctiva to the phonics, with sometimes anchoring with suture and amniotic membrane reconstruction using fibrin glue in the region of the bare scara.